Hi, this is Mar Haddad here. So in this uh, first lecture, I would like to make an introduction about Splinks. So why did I choose to make a course about Splinks? Because most of my courses, I would say that I have the, like 85% of my online courses, they speak about Microtech. And a lot of my students, they are whether ISPs or people working in ISPs, they use Microtech. And they want to have a system where they can do all the, the things that they want. So when it comes to the billing, uh, to the accounting, to the CRM, to the ticketing, and also to the networking. So it means that to create uh, accounts for user on PPPoE or on the HCP and do quality of service and do quotas and do a fair access policy, all of those things they really want uh, to have on one system. So in the market, there are a lot of uh, softwares uh, that you can use uh, to be able to uh, make it work with Microtech, but not only Microtech, with uh, any other brand as well, to be able to do all those things. But uh, I think that the, one of the best products that I have tested myself is Splinks. So uh, Splinks is a, a software uh, which you can uh, have it uh, uh, on place, so you can install it on a uh, uh, server or on a, a uh, virtual machine, but also it's possible that uh, you can uh, have it on the cloud to be able to do all the things uh, on your network. So you really want one software that can give you everything that you want uh, to be able to run your network, especially with the ISP's network. So this course is not sponsored by Splinks. Of course, I have spoken to them saying that I would like to make a course uh, for Splinks and they were very happy for that, but it's not in uh, any way sponsored uh, by Splinks. However, Splinks has uh, decided to uh, provide to, to you as students in case uh, you want to use Splinks in your network or in your ISP. So I will leave for you a link and then you can use that link to make the registration, which has my company name. And then once you do the registration, then they will recognize that you are coming on behalf of my company and then you will get directly 5% discount on the, their normal price that they have it on their website. That's amazing from Splinks that they have thought about you guys and uh, you can just use that link. You will get directly 5%. Of course, first you will have two weeks uh, free of charge to test Splinks and in case you want to use it, then uh, you will get directly 5% discount on all the billing that you are going to have with Splinks. So, now let's go directly and uh, see what is Splinks, what is the company and what do they do and what are the features of this software. And uh, then after that, we will start building up the course by doing a lot of labs using Splinks and I'm going to use with it a Microtech router. So what is Splinks? So Splinks is an ISP software made by people for people. What does it mean? Made by people for people, that means that Splinks uh, uh, people or employees, they always listen to their customers and uh, they listen to them to know what the features they want. And based on that, they will always implement the features that uh, their customers want. So that's something very nice from Splinks that they are not just like a software they provided and then they don't listen to customers. No, they always listen to customers and they see what the customer they have issues and how they can enhance their software to provide more features that their customers are asking for. And also one of the goal of the uh, Splinks is uh, to help local ISPs succeed in competing with large telco to build a profitable, fast-growing business. So we know that in every country, there are like large telcos, like uh, large ISPs. They have a lot of customers and so forth. But Splinks, uh, of course, it can sell to those uh, big companies, but for them, it's more that they are interested on uh, those companies that are small to medium size who would like to provide internet uh, so they want to become an ISP to their community, to their area. So they focus on those customers and uh, they try to uh, um, make them as big as possible to be able to compete with those uh, telco companies. Now, uh, this is a, a picture about the team of Splinks. Um, and then uh, you can see that the, the team that are located in Czech Republic, in Ukraine, South Africa, and in Spain. By the way, South Africa is a very, very, very big market for Splinks. They do have, I think, maybe the largest market uh, for them. There are already six years in the market, more than 700 uh, customers globally, and uh, the team member, there are 55 members. And uh, of course, uh, most of the members, they are uh, programmers, so they can always develop uh, new features on Splinks. Now, this is a global idea about Splinks. 
Um, now, what Splinks can do. So let's see what uh, they do. So Splinks makes it easy to sell internet, connect, build, and uh, support uh, your customers. So as you can see, it's really a software for ISPs. Normally, what we normally call it is a radio server. But it's not only a radio server. It can do a lot of more things that, uh, than uh, just the IP side. So it can do first the sales. So sell with the effort to having ISP effective CRM and tools tools at your fingerprints. So uh, on Splinks, there is a CRM software. So then in case, uh, for example, you can create a lead, um, you can uh, uh, communicate with a customer in case you want to approach him to buy your, your service. So there is a CRM system there to be able to do all this functionality. Then you have the billing and collection. So it's a peace of mind that all customers are built uh, and accounted uh, for automatically send invoice and collect payment. So we'll speak in a moment about the, the billing, but it's a very nice also feature that uh, you can, of course, do the billing. And uh, there are uh, uh, gateways uh, for payments. So you will see what are the gateways for payments. So with cash or PayPal or credit card or, or, or also all those are supported with things. Of course, there is also a possibility for support. Uh, they have a ticketing system. Uh, where uh, in case a customer has a problem, he can write you, then you, there is a ticket uh, number open, and then you can keep track with that customer until the ticket is closed. So also that's for the support. Field services effectively manage your customer on site, uh, install, track hardware, and solve problem even before they occur. So this is especially for the installers when they go to the, make the installation for the customer. So that is uh, available there. The network, network infrastructure, which is the most important, uh, I think, feature, is to manage your network centrally in a modern way, reducing amount of time spent on manual text tasks. So we can see what are the network management. So for example, PPPoE, DHCP, uh, uh, IP version 6, uh, management of the IP uh, addresses, all of those are provided by Splinks. And finally, inventory. Forget about having your inventory items on an Excel sheet, sell, rent, and manage your products with Splinks. So if you guys, for example, most of ISPs, they have a warehouse of hardware, and uh, those uh, hardware, um, you want to keep track what you have sold uh, and uh, uh, who, which customer has got uh, those uh, the, the the equipment and if he has paid all of those things we can track them using Splinks. So now I was speaking about the billings. Let's have a look about uh, what uh, Splinks has uh, as a billing. So it has a very accurate and reliable billing. So it's a billing engine designed around your requirement and an effective invoicing and payment collection. So what uh, uh, here Splinks uh, do is normally uh, they have a billing uh, uh, feature where uh, you can uh, build the customer and of course the customer can pay you and here they show you some different ways of payment so bank transfer cash task and payment gateway so that you work with sepa which is uh, the european uh, uh, payment or transfer of payments stripe netcash paypal parex but also if you want to have some other gateway they always uh, can uh, help you to provide that gateway for you but the good thing about splinks is that after you create, for example, the account for the customer, you make the billing and so forth. If you want to import all those information to some well-known uh, billing softwares like uh, QuickBooks or Xero or Sage, then uh, that's possible. And it works perfectly uh, between Splinks and uh, those uh, three softwares. Those softwares are for finance uh, uh, or accounting softwares that are very well known. So this is uh, the beauty of uh, Splinks as well for the billing. Now, when it comes about the uh, uh, um, monitoring of the uh, network. So uh, then uh, we have uh, a very stable and uh, carrier grade network. Make uh, use of uh, best in class tools uh, for uh, efficient network management. So for example, we can use ACS to, uh, with support of uh, TR69 protocol, which is a very nice uh, protocol. Um, uh, you can use it uh, on Splinks. And I have made a video on that on my YouTube channel. I will leave for you the link if you want to watch it with a small lab. It's just only one video. So what you can do, you can, um, for all your customers, uh, you can um, um, gain access to their modem. You can upgrade their firmware. You can change the configuration just from one place. Without you log into the, to their uh, routers, you don't have to connect to the, your uh, to their routers. The router has the TR69 uh, protocol enabled on Splinks as well. And then you can do uh, what you need to do on uh, Splinks directly. Okay, so there is also radio server and uh, API provisioning. So, of course, as I said, it is a radio server. So that's where you can create 
um, uh, the uh, accounts for the customers, whether on PPPoE or DHCP. Um, you can also create the quality of servers. You can do the quota. You can do the fair access policy. You can do pretty much uh, a lot of things for things that needed for ISP. Also, you can do the IP version 4 and IP version 6 management. So in case you have a range of public IPs, you want to subnet them. Uh, so all the things you can do them via Splinks and then you know what to assign to your customers as for IP addresses. And finally, you can also do the device monitoring and backup. So you can just every device you can monitor what it's doing and you can do backup of uh, its uh, configuration. Now, the last slide for uh, this lecture is to speak about the operational management and control. As I have said to you, that uh, Sphinx has a feature which is the CRM. So uh, there is a CRM and customer portal you can give to your customer uh, uh, access uh, uh, to the portal where he can um, uh, make contact with you. And there is CRM, you can do also some type of scheduling. So if you want to know, or you say that this customer has to be installed on this date or on that date, so all these things you can do the scheduling. Um, help desk, so uh, this, let's say if you have support 24-7, and then uh, they can be reached and uh, your customer will write you, uh, they will get it, uh, a ticket uh, number. So that's a ticketing system that uh, can uh, run on Spring. And the inventory management, like I said, it's all about um, if you uh, have a warehouse of hardware, you want to provide it to your customer. Once uh, they uh, want to get the service from you, then you know where the hardware is and what you have sold and what you still have in stock. And uh, so this is what it looks here. So this is a to do, so there's more to be the schedule, uh, what has been done here. So yeah, this is um, um, pretty much uh, the things that I wanted to explain in uh, this lecture. So this is the introduction about Splinks. Now you know what features Splinks they have. And so it's not only for networking part. So just creating username and password, giving PPPoE or the SCP or quality of service or whatever. No, it's just like all in one uh, software where uh, every ISP, if they got Splinks, they can do all of those things. So you don't need anymore to have a ticketing system uh, or you buy a ticketing system or you buy a CRM for the leads and the opportunities and uh, to do the sales and to reply to your customer for new uh, requests and so forth. Everything is uh, there on one software. And that's why I really decided to uh, make a, a, a course about Splinks. And I'm very excited to show you all the, the features or let's say most of the feature uh, which I can show you in this course. So uh, then you are convinced uh, uh, in case you want to run Splinks in your ISP, then you know more about it. Now, I would like to remind you that I will leave with this video my affiliate link that I got it from Splinks so I can share it with you and you can get the 5% discount in case you decide that you want to continue or you want to get the, the uh, software from Splinks, then you will be eligible to get 5% discount on uh, all the purchases that you do with Splinks. So thank you very much for the time you spent watching this video and I will see you in the upcoming one.